After my latest update to my phone's operating system to Android Nougat, I was having problems with the Breeze Cam app connecting to the Breeze via Wi-Fi. I was also having problems with the controller itself connecting to the Breeze Cam app via Bluetooth. As shown in my latest video, this video here shows that I figured out what to do in order to connect the Breeze Cam app to the Breeze via Wi Fi and what to do to connect the controller to the Breeze Cam app via Bluetooth. <clears throat> um, here's what I have to do. First thing is to power up the breeze. <clears throat> then I'll start the breeze cam app. And what I'll do is I'll search for Wi Fi for the breeze. As you can see right here, the breeze is connecting. <clears throat> via Wi-Fi connected to the Wi-Fi network to the breeze but when you go into the app itself it still shows that the breeze is not connected there is no power indicator showing that the breeze is connected to the app <clears throat> so in order for that to ha for me to get that to work I have to click on tasks FPV and now everything is connected via Wi-Fi now you can see that the sh it's showing that the power meter is working and, and all the satellite settings and everything else works now for me to get the controller connected to the app via Bluetooth what I'll do is I'll switch from the goggles setting to the controller setting power it on now it's connected a game controller successfully once it's connected a game controller successfully I'll count to 15 seconds 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 Hit experience now and now everything works I'm able to use the controller now